connected. Channel switched. Yeah. What's good about it? My figure just crashed. What? That sucks. I don't think I've had a game crash since I started running the new uh, stuff. Well, I've only had flight gear on three times this week. Too busy, so. It's because we're in France. Yeah. French. Seems to be aircraft scattered everywhere. Yeah, hopefully they'll find me. For every, guys on uh, Team Speak, we're going to use uh, this runway where I'm at, which happens to be the E07 la 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 left. Oh, fuck. Where about to the glider settings in the menu? I can't remember. Uh, what? All I see is gliders. Um, give it a minute for them to load in, or sometimes, depending on what server you're on, that'll happen. To me, for me, it's taken a long time for things, people to load in, load in tonight. Usually, that means you don't have that model. But if, if you pull up the um, the pilot list, are they orange or are they white? Orange, but I downloaded the pack, so I'm not sure what's going on. Uh, you don't just put the pack, the, the single folder, you get to put all the individual subfolders into the aircraft folder. Yeah, you gotta unzip it to the, uh, you, you gotta, you gotta release them. You gotta let them be free. Release the crack in. <laughs> yeah, release the crack in. Release the crack in. Look at that guy pounding his head against a, a wall. You can release the crack head if you want it all. <laughs> You're not going to get out of there, Porky. <laughs> well, I'm slowly taxiing down to the end of the runway, I think. Somebody going face on it. That's the Is it the right line? It oh, it fell over. Somebody touched the brakes. <laughs> Has anybody else had problems with the scenery around um, Paris or like? I always have problems with Paris. Um, yeah, and it's, it's a big, been the biggest blank. Uh, Square for ages and yeah, I, right to it and stuff. To I, try left and make my, it load. I left my machine running on Terrace yesterday for a good few quarters on hour to try and get User it. joined your channel. It still had to be It'll take a lot. Yeah, it takes a lot to load it. I, I should have warned you guys. You should have. I yeah, should have. Damn it. User joined your channel.
Good thing there isn't any mountains in the area apart from the Eiffel Tower. Oh, have you tried flying through the tower yet? There'll be a mountain of dead planes, surely. Oh no, come on, these are easy. Way. Yoo-hoo, Sunny! Sunny, on a roof. Not very well. Irish linen dope. Oh, yeah. Well, yeah, the dopes are Irish. Yeah. But what? Oh, wait. Don't know what the Germans use instead of linen. Toilet the paper. Possibly. Yay, I'm spinning. Why are you spinning? Oh no. Ozzy, I love that livery. Where are we going to stop? Uh, 07 left. this thing out of fuel, you're doing some crazy flying there, bro. It's been known to happen. <laughs> I'm sure. Never mind, never mind him, just, just drive through it. Turnouts shows you how many crazy asses we have <laughs> for these events. Crazy invitation. Can you go see my albatross? Because I can't see yours. Hmm. I, uh, I, I, I could see what albatross. FG6834. Uh, no, I don't see you. What server are you in? I mean, I don't I didn't even see a glider. I don't even see I don't see you on the pilot list. Um, I see him on the pilot list, but I'm I'm on it. Unless you are FG6834, are you? Yeah. Did you forget to change your the pilot name? It's in rogue, oh my god! I can't see someone with an A in 225. That's not with us anyway. Oh, now I got a glider on FG6834. Well, um. So did it stop? There's something. It takes forever for ship to load in here. It's, I blame it on uh, the Lots of them smoking. Ah, I got FG 6834. Oh, trust. We're seeing, we're lots, we're seeing lots of smoke. Um, we don't have the latest, latest download that. Yeah, you gotta get the new one. I did a win, so I just I downloaded it today. I I don't know. I don't know. Hit shift S maybe you when you you turn your smoke on. Yeah, now the smoke's off. So maybe I hit smoke on by accident. Yeah, it happens to me when I start sometimes. You fall out sometimes. That, that, well that too, but 
Yay! Look, the pink smoke's off! Purple smoke. Nothing. Savage smoke. Savage smoke. I'm afraid I will have a frame rate problem tonight with all this uh, city stuff. But I just try if it works. Yeah. I don't know. I, 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 I worried about doing this, but the, I'm flying it this week, being called a terrorist <laughs> repeatedly by the local pilots. Uh, my frame rates are like 40 ish right now. We're about to pass. Four seven left. I'm on the other side, so really cannot see. User joined your channel. My favorite spad livery and road. Why, if he goes to Texas any faster? They wanted me to come airborne about 40 knots, so. There we go, we are no live on Twitch. User joined your channel. Hi, Mom. Time is of the essence. Ready for my briefs? Um, oh, never ready for my briefs. But they're good tonight, they've been watching, so. First off, uh, weather is border of a high pressure region. Time settings time is straight up mini and noon. No white rudder. Damn. I need to be right back. You don't have any right rudder. Initially, we are going to depart this airport, our original starting point on 07 left. And we are going to follow the runway vector to make to be 70 degrees. Then uh, I'll lay in the autopilot. We're going to visit some of the local airports. Some of them are cool. Some of them have flashing buildings. Woo! -hoo. Some of them are just like not so bad, not so great. Um, until we get to uh, Lima, Foxtrot, Papa, Victor, in which case we're going to turn to 100 degrees until we meet the river Sen. Then we're going to turn left, fly up the river. 500 extra FGUK points, bucks, um, for anybody that wants to fly under. Bridges, ask me first. I know which ones you can't get under. Some of them you, you can get under, but there's something under them that crashes you. So, in which case, um, none of these aircraft really have crash code in them. So, if you hit Control R and go into replay, you just rewind the thing forward, take control of the aircraft before the crash, you can get right back in the saddle. How cool is that? Not that you'll need to do that. I'm sure everyone will be fine. 
So, which one of these uh, things are you? I should be, I should be the yellow albatross in the in the lead, up second, second from the front. Bright yellow, right? Okay. That's me. Blue yellow. Wow. What sort of uh, height are we going at? Thousand feet. I'm gonna cap at one zero five knots. Gives you guys about ten or fifteen knots to catch up or do whatever. Whatever. Initially, we're just gonna be cruising at a thousand feet, checking out these airports until everybody gets used to these vicious flying monsters. Who's not ready to go? I was born ready, but not for this. Here we go. between the two aircrafts that you are in front of me. Why the fuck does it be? Fun watching the dudes. You're cruel, man. I'm up, I'm cooking. This thing got this within the kitchen. Look for the red smoke. Ha ha! Well, there's a lot of airplanes in the air, so I'm assuming most of you have taken off. I see flashing lights. That's gotta be Sonny. With the rescue job, I hope. Yay! Good girl. Good job. Red smokes does appear. There you go. Did you get the latest uploads? User disconnected from your channel. No, I don't think I have the latest version. Uh, then you're not going to see this one. More were killed in training accidents than the combat. Alright, turn it on destination for our first airport, which will be Lima, Foxtrot, Papa, Victor, GPS, FMS 115. I'm in a thousand feet, 105 knots. Catch up. Right, catch up. Four minutes, you got four minutes. Four minutes! You need more smoke? Yes. We always need more smoke. Broken prayers, that's what these flight nights run on. Awesome. 
Mr. Yankee and his albatross. What flavor is that albatross, Oscar Yankee? We don't know. The yes, uh, true. <laughs> what? Well, duh, get extra up to UK bucks for that. Well, see, if you can fly inverted through the uh, the Eiffel Tower, um, you get a thousand up to UK bucks. Please say when we uh, get near the Eiffel Tower. Yeah, Eiffel Tower. That's almost like a mark Okay, I want to know who else sees this. This building ahead of us with all the light switches shorted out, it's flashing off and on. Me. See something. I see. Is that cool or what? I don't know if it's cool, it's probably very dangerous. But... Why uh, are you looking? You look at where we're going, Just it's just down to your left. Yeah, there is shit in the middle of the tower. That's right, Flash. Very observant. Well, tourists and the French get things done. Well, you know, if the tourists aren't there, you got to make it do something. You know, like... it, it makes it interesting trying to fly through it because you got to dodge the wind, ship, wind tower. Here we are at our first destination. We watch me through the turn. Then 10,000 feet. I'm at 105 knots. Should give you some leeway to catch up. Not much, but some. I think that building actually important. It's saying something to us. Yeah, I'm saying it's got like Morse code or something, eh? FMS 294. Why don't we find down the motorways in the middle of the building? You can do that if you want to. No, it looks like mods behind me. Don't the mods go off? Us on the on the pilot on the flight list, we hit some of these airports a couple of times because the scenery is so cool. Plus, it gives you a chance to, to kind of gather some of it so you can see what happens when we get to the Eiffel Tower. Can you believe I was called a terrorist a couple times this week? No, I was. Oh. <laughs> oh, Why? <laughs> because I was flying low up the river and around the Eiffel Tower. And I was flying one of these. Most pilots don't get it. And, more, it? and a mosquito, but nobody can see that one yet. Oh, man, this 
mosquito is so sexy. Oh my goodness. I've wanted a, my own my own mosquito for forever since I was a baby. The building one in uh, the UK, the flying one. Yeah, they've got, they've got the parts now. I can't miss it. Is it somewhere in Australia or is it New Zealand that are making the parts for them? Really? So, it's, it'll be in New Zealand because they've made one before. That's it, yep. Wow, a real one you're talking about? Yeah, you can oh, buy yeah. a brand new You need a lot of money, right? But you can get one. We've got the molds and they make the wooden fuselages for the set wind seconds. Yeah, it's a bit harder to come by the mill in engines, though. Yes. I did not put uh, some substitutes for them. For the ones that were not melons. I don't, I don't know. I don't think so. Why am I falling behind? What the hell's going on? Maybe you're out of fuel. <laughs> I, I see an I see a big monkey tower over there. There's a bunch tower. of big monkey towers around here. Back we're headed the direct direction we're headed now, you can probably see the Eiffel Tower from here. I just say it up it. Can't see it myself. There is a tower. I don't think it's the My three o'clock position, I see the Eiffel Tower. Yes, yes, okay. you do. Yeah. So I love the traffic on the roads. Sonny's perspective, our rescue chopper. Just in case somebody falls down and scrapes their knees. When somebody falls down. Not if. Aw. <laughs> he is so, he's so negative, bro. Well, he is the one that slid down here. Watch me for the turn. I'm about to sit all the time. On left. Here we go. We GPS FMS 40 degrees, maintain 1000 feet. 105 catch with me. I can eat some valves. Ooh, nice proximity, guys. This is great video. It's actually another unfinished airframe. Watch me for the turn right to 100 degrees. Right 100 degrees heading bug. Mark, turning right to 100 degrees until we hit the river. Well, sorry, we're on the river. Stand by. Follow me. Really hard to do when I can't see anything. But Damn it! Oh. Why can you not see anything? Because it's a spad. Can't see the front. Look at the side. Now 
Out on the river, boys. Saw Sandy go past me, I think. Do not fly through the buildings, even though you think you can. Is it fun to uh, fly under some of these bridges? Absolutely, 500 FGU K buck for everyone. Um, some, of, some of them, but some of them, you'll get trapped. Um, this big I one, okay. Didn't, uh, get trapped under this. This big one right here, you can fly under it. Yep, you can. See the Eiffel Tower now? Here you go, yeah. kids. Well, here you go. I want to see everybody make five passes through one of the levels. Go. <laughs> Which level? Doesn't matter. It's all for fun. <laughs> oh god, I still get a kick out of that shit. Where's the gorilla on the top? I'm landed there, yeah. He's he's there, he's there. King Kong. I did not believe I would actually pull this off. I figured we'd all be dead by now. <laughs> Remember, if you crash into something, not like I know this personally because I never hit anything, but uh, you can just hit Control R and then pick up on the replay someplace and catch back up. You know, if you're going through the upper level, you have to do uh, like, it's like bit, uh, a medieval uh, salt course. You get this mist miss of spinny blades as well. The wind turbines are right in the middle. Yeah, you have to turn your wings vertical on the second level, or th otherwise you hit the wind thing. <laughs> oh my god, this is too much fun. Time through. Look at you! You can't even see nothing, you liar! Yeah, I'm just going through it right now. I'm gonna find one of you guys and follow them. It's so quiet, you guys are all concentrating. <laughs> What's that building with the big gold dome? Whoa, that's some crazy flying there, brother. Oh, that was cool. I was saying, but I think it's a bit too pointy. What's too pointy? The top of the Eiffel Tower to land on. Oh, yeah, I know about that. I've done five times three. Look at you. Okay, well, hang out for the rest of us. How is everybody doing?
that when we leave here, we're gonna fly. Forgotten how detailed Paris was. Oh, is this fabulous or what? I don't know why you guys' frame rates are. Mine are fab. Oh, I saw a spad going through. I'm surprised we can pull it off at all. I figured we'd all get like one FPS and die, but... Hey, with, uh, I just noticed this is the, the, the eco version of the Diaper Tower. I almost so it doesn't need any new friends, man. It's a fireman. Oh, 17 FPS isn't bad, is it? I mean... No. For this level of scenery and this many aircraft, I think 17 is fine. Okay. Let's see if we can find the red smoke. Spotted. Follow me, boys! Get my speed limiter back on my fancy autopilot. River, past the, past the Eiffel Tower. Say goodbye, boys. Bye, boys. Some of these bridges are capable of being uh, barnstormed, and some of them will kill you, so choose wisely. I found if you stay to the left side, you're generally okay. I don't know why it matters, but it does. Woohoo! Watch this, boys, hold my beer. So the water seems to be quite tough now. Seems to be, doesn't it? Check out this bridge, man. Cool things. Four lanes. If you tried to fly yeah. anywhere near Paris, you were done. Well, it's still pretty freaking heavy, though. 
Oh yeah, still, but it's doable for me. Is it not? Is it like really bad for you? Um, mean FPS. But it's jelly. About two or three FPS. Oh, that's unnegotiable. I apologize for that. I'm on 25. Look at you. I was on. I was on 12 when we were in the middle of Paris. Won't be able to do it in an helicopter, though, I think. Yeah, choppers, if you ain't running at least 12 or 15 FPS, it's like... <laughs> Crashed three times at midpoint last week, trying to get off the ground to give up in the end. Just got pissed <laughs> off with it. Yeah, that'll do it. And I don't know why that midpoint airport should have been harder to fly off from, from the starting point. Before the scenery got turned up, Germany has always been heavy on FPS. No idea why. Um, most of that b before in the day was because they were trying to use multiple. Let's see if I can say this right. Um, we had to square smoke because they were trying to use um, multiple um, files. And Rogue probably knows more about it than I do, but there was a. Uh, an issue with the square smoke and stuff like that, and that was just killing us. Somewhere they just crashed. Ah! Oh, is that Voodoo Dying? That was Voodoo Dying. I found the bridge that wasn't the couple of things live under. Some of them, they just won't let you do it. What were you saying earlier about not running into stuff? Hey, sometimes it doesn't matter. That was a clean run. I just hit something under the bridge. I don't know what it was. I gotta find you guys again. I'm behind you. I'm still following the river. Oh, there I am. There you are. I caught up rather quickly. You and your PC at the end of this year. See the price is stabilized some more. Dude. Yeah, let me know when that ends in about 15 years. Yeah, uh, graphics card prices are coming down. Sweet! Should have an exchange service where when somebody upgrades, they sell on their own machine to somebody User who's got even older one. Your channel. That's probably do that. I have an eGPU. Check out this one. Whoa. Okay. This one goes through the hard drive, won't be a white machine, and then uh, one up. Alright, I'm gonna head uh, head for our midpoint destination, which is not too far away. Stand by, I'll give you the F I'll give you the uh, the heading. Mark, uh, GPS FMS 59 degrees, going back to 1,000 feet, 105 knots, gives you some leeway to catch me fine. Still, st still streaming smoke. should be aware with this multiplayer where you don't really need to use the resources so much of your own machine. It could be done on the server somehow. Ah. It's, it's not architected that way. So, but the, the multiplayer server really just passes packets from between different uh, clients. It just tells tells everybody what their position is and 
some information about their state, like their um, animation. uh, the animations, yeah. And stone. Zero degrees, heading bug nine zero, my mark, standby. Turning right nine zero degrees till we line up with that runway here at uh, Lima Foxtrot Pop Up Bravo. Oh, we landed here, are we? Yes, sir. Everybody's a glider now. Who's upside down? That's awful. <laughs> That's it's awesome. Here, are we? Yes, sir. On this runway right in front of us. Yes, sir. Really? Yes, sir. Holy shit, how are we going to bleed speed up? Christ. I'll unzip my jacket and look at the flap. Just can just drag your arms and feet. Didn't you put your white? Didn't you put your white uh, silk scarf on? I did. Actually, I'm sitting here with it on right now. Drop flaps. Oh wait. Oh wait, there aren't any. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> I'm zigzagging to try and bleed the speed off. Faster. Tap the brakes, boys. Doesn't do any good in the air. That's an Ariane. There's a couple of Ariane rockets to the right. Lighting in at 90 knots. Head for the tower, kids. I don't think I've got any choice in which direction I'm heading, Jesus Christ. <laughs> nope, it's going the other way. Uh. Somebody's taxing and all of a sudden they take off. <laughs> That's a spad that put it on the ground. Yay. You guys in the lead, take that next right. Take that next right. I'm on the grass. Look at you. Wouldn't tell everybody that. I like it. You'll be a ter you'll be a terrorist. Just run me over. Hey, 
There's Sonny. Hi, Sonny. No, it's not Sonny. What am I saying? It's that dude that called me a terrorist. Where are you going? Uh, go right here. Park up on the grass underneath the tower. Please. All right, under Ionix then. Yeah, are you going underneath that chopper? There's Sun. Parked. Nice hopper, Sunny. Sunny's not hollow. I swear I'm getting draft from that big chapter. Turning off the auto scenery. Oh yeah, you're the auto download. Short break, refresh, refuel. Engine mm. off. Which of these has a better view? Is the, the the albatross is not good. not a more great. The albatross is pretty good. Mm. I'll, I'll I'll stick with the spad because I know how to fly it now. <laughs>
user disconnected from your channel. I'm back, back on Tom's. Sorry, Sonny, you reversed it. That's my excuse.
quite funny if you watch Reanix and that you walk up the crew, he can fly. Oh yeah, he was putting that, he was making that thing walk and rock and roll here uh, earlier this week. He's no, he's no fool. Oh no, it's the difference between rock and roll and there. He was at it when I was scaling the scenery and he didn't You gather your scenery on the multiplayer. Yep. Yeah, I just spawn at the airport. Let the scenery down, looking at a run. And it tells me ready. Ready. Sometimes it took me to that sitting at the airport for 40 minutes before it did it. I always gather the scenery, uh, uh, you know, not on multiplayer. Does it make a difference? No. 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 I just do it to annoy the locals as much as possible and alert them to flight night that we'll be here on the weekend. Plus I've been developing, like I said, I was working on the B-26 Marauder here and the Mosquito here. And that way every time I spawn in, you, uh, I was testing flight FDMs and the Mosquito and tweaking them. And you know, I just keep spawning in the different airports that we're going to fly at and that way I can load up the scenery. I don't have to do it on multiplayer, I just do. Alright, we're going to hold runway vector and then we're going to head for uh, Lima, uh, Foxtrot, Papa, Golf, LFPG. Hi guys and lady, I just want to say good night. I have to make it a day because well, brain rate stuff, and my daughter just told me she, that she broke her hand while dancing. Ah! Not oh, my no. night. What the hell was she doing dancing to break her hand? She fell on the hand while formation dancing. Oh, Modern dance. Hopefully she's okay. Uh, so I hope as well she has to be operated on probably. Oh, Lean says it's break dancing. <laughs> Something like that, yeah. <laughs> oh tell her Good luck, mate. Thanks for coming. Thanks. See you in a fortnight, probably. See you later. Good night. User Watch disconnected from go. your channel. Watch. Tagging it. Same thing, 105 knots. I'll be at 105 knots, gives you guys some leeway. Gonna hold runway back then we're gonna make a turn, I'll call it out. Thousand feet. Yep. Okie dokie then. Turning to uh, GPS FMS 6565, my mark, stand by. Mark, turning right, 6566 now, um, to 1,000 feet, 105. Uh, destination Lima Foxtrot Papa Golf. In about four minutes. Red buffer. Red buffer. Thank you for the red smoke. I just installed the new version of the of the 
Waggling their wings. Black buildings. Oh yeah. A Lewis gun on the go. <laughs> Was it a Vickers? I don't know. I mean, it's all what the Vickers, wasn't it? It's probably a Vickers. Faster than Voodoo this time, Jesus. I don't know. It's raining. Oh, oh, I just got a That could be why I was having issues loading the scenery at this airfield. Oh, I didn't think about that. See, I did not see that earlier. Guru, could you please turn on the smoke again? It's grass, it's just very, very dark grass. Um, exactly. It's, it's well, I, I've, right been, I've, I've been getting black mountains for the last couple of weeks. And they, they come and they go. What is that? It's rated temptation later. Guys, all of these aircraft have smoke. It might be cool for the video right now for everybody just to get shipped out, turn on their smoke for a minute. I want to see what it looks like over MP. Just turn mine on. <laughs> I love it! <laughs> oh my god, that's cool! It's white because then be red, green, white. Should be uh, red, green, blue, white, and uh, like a purple, like a pinkish purple. Mine's white. Mine's green. Mine's red. It should properly be. New GPS FMS 170, dude. Our next to the next destination, Lima Foxtrot, Papa Lima. Ooh, that's a nice looking airport under us, boys and girls. The boys. Oh my goodness. That's a drive set with a Land Rover on 
Right, F-16 cool. is flying very uh, high angle of attack. Kill smoke. Yep. Um, I don't really think they can do that. <laughs> Probably it's, not. It's fly gear, you know, it's completely accurate. Well, it's a GSB scene, seven, the F-16, so it's, it's the bee's knees, you know? The bee's knees, oh my. It's, it's, it can't be wrong. If loving that is wrong, I don't want to be right. So, you guys can kill that smoke if you want. I was just wanting to see what yeah. it looks like. I'm getting too fucked. Yeah. Turned off. <laughs> I'm okay. He does have a chemical comp component that is known to cause um, cancer in people who live in California, though. Take like it, you don't live in California. No! I'm always amazed at the things that we use every day, but you get in and there's a warning that says if you, you know, this has been known to cause cancer in California. Well, we're not in California, so. Well, there are chemists, one the industrial chemist who invented put, putting lead in petrol, uh, something else, DDT, I think he invented, and then he broke his neck falling out of bed. <laughs> He's killed more people than Hitler, Stalin, put together. No, that's an unbelievable. And he, he died by falling out of bed? You don't think that's cosmic justice or what? Yeah, I think, I think he had polio and he invented some kind of pulley system to uh, lift him, move him around. I think he might have done CCF, you know, the refrigerant gases as well. So you wish the million fire Imagine in California, that, uh, well, quite all of the United States have managed to those acres. I don't think it kids got to. Can't work that one out. Explain that one, Voodoo. Just that many. I don't thought you may have some experience with the place that says you've lived there all your life. I think you can, I think I think you can take uh Chancellor of the Exchequer, he likes living in America. Do he's, what? Got green, he's got a green card. I had it had it back now. Well, Very much so. He was always uh, uh, played up to be the next big thing in the, in the, in the politics, but um, he's just a up his own arse flat, to be honest. They had, a, they had a mini budget last week or week before, and he went to a petrol station because it's not 5p off the price of a litre of petrol, but he didn't know how to pay for it. So he was filling out somebody's, uh, one of the workers at the petrol stations. Uh, Cars to look like he's a man of the people, and then he bought a can of coke and he didn't know how to pay for it. <laughs> who's, who's this? A uh, chancellor of the executor. Oh my god. But he's being shafted by the prime minister because he doesn't want him to take his job, so they, they've dumped a load of shit about his wife. Who's, uh, she's Indian and so she's got this tax status where she doesn't have to pay any taxes in this country. You forgot to mention that she's richer than the Queen. Yeah. <laughs> she, she, only, she only gets about 11 million uh, pounds of uh, interest off her, off her shares. A year. Is she looking for a dude, dude? Well, since he's lost her, her status, she, and because of him now, he, she'll, have, she'll have to pay tax. She might have dumped, you know? But best ones, she was actually claiming uh, the uh, furlough money for some gyms she had some shares in, and uh, they all went bankrupt, and it's left her in about six and a half million pounds to the creditors. What it changed the for? There were some gyms or something in London. 
and she was getting furlough money for during the COVID lockdowns. Yeah, but six million is just pocket money, too. Oh man, yeah, me too. <laughs> Yeah, well, this is the people that run our country, and people keep voting them in. They think they're wonderful. Um, well, User well, in your channel timed out. It's very similar to uh, you know your people voting in no, Trump, being a man of the people and look doing everything to help uh, all your citizens of your country. Meanwhile, they were trying to shut down uh, shut down the government to let the Russians in. Yeah, here, here's the problem with the voting thing, which I'm all a big fan of the democratic election. You get a choice between black or white, one or zero, and neither one of them is the answer. There's where, why we are where we are. It's because no matter who you pick, they all work for the same asshole. Someone with more money than God. That's my opinion. I'll now step off my soapbox. Thank you. This message is brought to you by Voodoo Da Vinci, and I have approved this message. Did you pay tax on that soapbox? Of course I did. I pay tax on everything. <laughs> Turning um, a really a right. New GPS FMS 243. You can get a thousand feet. You guys are in good formation. We seem to have picked up a cougar. Uh. It's, I'm always amazed that Rayonic shows up on all of our flights, but never brings the specified aircraft. It's amazing. I think he's turned up with an helicopter when it's been an helicopter flight now once or twice. Yeah, but not one of our helicopters. I think he's French. Now he's got one of our helicopters, but not specified for this flight. That's you know he does it to try and wind people up or not. This has been recorded on video. Initial and left. Same pet EME page. What did the route manager say? Next destination is LFPO, Lima Foxtrot, Papa Oscar, Paris Orly, Orle, Orle, Orle. Orle! Orle! Four minutes, 45 EME seconds. Yeah, them buildings around the centre of Paris look, look didn't, didn't look, you know, normally they look very artificial, don't they, the OSM buildings? Well, uh, Paris has had uh, somebody modelled Paris, the centre of Paris, a long time ago with proper buildings and all the rest of it, so... And I've never been able to really visit it, and then the other day I was like, well, we already did this, we already did that, blah, 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 let's do something crazy, let's see what Paris looks like, and I... I spawned here and started flying around. I'm like, this is way cool. Hopefully we can have a flight here. And we've managed pretty good so far. I mean, it, we, this, over in the city, some of the frame rates suck rocks, but it's still worth seeing, right? Yeah, the, the next scenery tile isn't loading again. This is the one, uh, I think it must be that big airport. It um, just won't have it. It'll load. Give it time, mate. It'll, oh my goodness, I'm looking... Uh, Looking over my starboard wing there toward uh, the main part of the city or whatever. It's fabulous. It's only running 14 FPS, but... These aircraft yeah. are pretty easy going on, uh, on frame rates anyway. Well, uh, there's nothing sophisticated about them, so they don't use up much resources. Exactly. Yeah, well, I've flown this route all afternoon and it struggled all afternoon. It looks like it's not going to be there. I think I had to float, you know, just keep going in a straight line. Luckily, there's no mountains to run into. Try and not make it in Paris. Simple. Generally, there's not many mountains in Paris. No. <laughs> not in Paris. 
They seem to have enough airport, so I don't know. Oh, they do. no. They're all over the bloody place. And they all look pretty nice. There's our flashing building again, boys. Shooting from Oscar Yankees perspective, it's like <laughs> you, know, you don't have to push the stick all the way one direction, brother. <laughs> you can like you can just push it a little bit and it'll respond. <laughs> oh god, I love these things. Yeah, so it's a bit like disc world at the moment for me. I'm just flying off the edge of the uh, disc. Be a big turtle or an elephant or something supporting the planet underneath. You kind of feel like Christopher Columbus flying off the end of the world, eh? They be dragons, but beyond this point. <laughs> yeah, but they don't have teeth. So. Head for Middle Earth. They don't have teeth. Allegedly. Now you went to the middle of the earth and there were aliens and the Alps on you. Huh? User joined your channel. User! Oh, That's three weeks without Gary, by the way. Goodness. Shoot from Flash's perspective, coming out of this airport. Very nice, very nice. Very nice. Take your word for that, I haven't seen it so Aww, far. dude. That sucks. That building is flashing a lot, isn't it? It is. It I is think there's a short in the fuse box someplace. That looks like... That looks odd. <laughs> I'm telling you, it's more scored. Wait, the dash, the dash, the dash, the dash, the dash, the dash. You don't know there's, there's a building in Paris out there that's flashing like that. You don't know it's not real. I'm pretty sure it's not, but... Alright, execute the left turn, new GPS FMS 119er, 119er. Maintain 1,000 feet. Look at the cool airports. I, I do like this airport, despite the flashing building. Very, very cool, very cool. So we turn this, you can look behind, you can see what I call downtown or midtown Paris. The Eiffel Tower's back there in the back off the Seine River. And so just, it just looks, somebody has spent a lot of freaking time working on this and kudos to that, and thank you. Very cool. So it's all OSM, but there's a hell of a lot of custom buildings in it as well. Exactly, oh. somebody has, somebody's been really serious. London time. It's not 10 p.m. London time. Exactly, it's not. It's 20 past 9 in London time. No, it's just the answer to the question of when this is finishing. Oh. Oh, oh, there's a go. Look at you, clever boy. I don't know the question. The scenery just popped back in there. See the red smoke? Yeah. I knew it would show up if you hung around long enough, brother. Yeah, them OSM buildings do look a bit toy townish, don't they? Just needs a better texture on them, that's all. 
Yeah, but we're at a thousand feet too, so you can reach down there and spit on them. If you get up and fly faster, they look, you know, it's pretty real looking. You figured out the spat, eh, did you, and Rogue? Yeah. yeah. Can you see enough to make it worth your while now? Yep. Yay. I'm still, work still working out how to land without bouncing, though. <laughs> yeah. You, you gotta yeah. get the ground about 40 knots. Remember that there wouldn't be landing on runways that they deserve. No. There'd just be a grass field into they like it. grass. Um, yeah. They also wouldn't have steerable tail wheels, which we have, or differential braking, which we have. So we cheat. We're cheating, but it's it's still fun, kind of. Mm. Stuart Probably breaks out the, in the hives. Early one, the early ones would have been dead stick landings as well, because the no throttle, just ignition on, on Exactly, and off. on or off. You're either at full power or the engine's off. Watching this, watching this museum program and it was the first Triumph motorbike and in a right weird fuel and carburetor system it was running on brake fluid in a tank and the carb was inside the tank and it sort of does it on like absorption and you had to mess around with all these little rods to keep the flow rate the right Oh my goodness but it was none but the first ever uh, Triumph motorbike built in about 1901. And it was just a motor, it was like a bike with a little engine on it. That was my big rage for quite a few years was collecting um, uh, Colt Model M pistols that were first designed 1898, I think, or whatever. And, originally patented in the early 1900s, like one of the first automatic pistols. And uh, I have several of them and I just, it is so cool. I can, I mean, like in the same era, I have several pistols from the same era, 1918, 1914. Um, I mean, they're still over a hundred years old, shoot like a sharp pair of scissors. I would love to fly an original or even just play with an original, you know, World War One style aircraft because it's just cool stuff. Well, most of the ones in the UK are now are uh, replicas, what they actually fly. Yeah, I love them. Even I think it was a replica that they were flying, but they open up that front cowling and then take an oil can and squirt all this stuff. There's no, there's no oil system. There's no lubrication system. They just squirt it with the oil. Talking of replicas, do you guys know that they, a long time ago, they reopened the production line of the FW190? Really? Yeah, they were making them <laughs> for a while, oh. but with the with a different engine. With a Schwitz off radio. Oh my God. Well, they made the Messerschmitts in in Spain, and they used Merlin engines. Yeah. After the Second World War. So most of the uh, ME109s, what you see at air shows, they're, they're not true. What Messerschmitts? No. They used the the Spanish ones in the Battle of Britain as well. But uh, the original engines are very complicated arrangements, and there's not many people can actually work on them. The BMW injectors. Yeah, it's built upside down, so uh, you know the oil's draining the wrong direction. Yeah, it's a DB605 inverted V. It also doesn't it doesn't go stupid in negative G's. Oh, that's just because it's fuel injected. But they only did that because they had a tour of Rolls Royce and saw some kind of development model. And they thought, oh, that looks pretty, let's do that. So 
Nice formation. Yeah, you guys are in close proximity. This is great. I got some great video. Thank you. Need to practice formation flying more often. Oscar Yankee, you can turn uh, the smoke off, bro. The silver leg. Conversation going on here in the chat that I can see when we see dances. I don't know how those guys fly and type at the same time. These young people have nimble fingers, I gotta say. What's cool about uh, running these flights, planning the flight, then trying to be flight leader and then shoot the video at the same time as when things are simple like they are right now. It's cool because I can I can like cruise around and shoot from other people's perspective and get all kinds of stuff. Oh, there's a turn while I'm blabbering away. New GPS FMS 309 mates. Destination now of uh, Lima Foxtrot X ray uniform. We will fly past the uh, the Eiffel Tower and stuff again because we might have another crack. We got plenty of time, so we might have another crack. At, uh, there's there's a couple of bridges down the, on the river there by, by the tower that are begging me to fly under them, which I did earlier. I don't know what my obsession is with barnstorming these things, but I come by it normally. It's, it's not really the perversion it seems. Special and left. It's nice to catch up at the end, row. We haven't seen you from the Coons Age, man. Yep, I just don't get any time anymore. Eh, I just retired in January. I rage quit in January and then decided to turn it into retirement. So I'm like, I, I feel horrible for you guys if you're still pounding your neck against the wall. Yeah, that's, uh, I wish I could retire, to be honest. First, the instant I did, the economy went to dog shit. I haven't earned any money on my time and income fund, so. But I made it through the first quarter, so we'll see what happens. Maybe I have to go back to the part time job. I'll be where I want invest, invest in weapons manufacturing. <laughs> good idea. That's a good suggestion, sir. Yeah, yeah, you won't lose money on that in a while. Not the short run. Not the short run, we won't. Bit I could talk at is we inv uh, invaded uh, Iraq for no particular reason, and but the war do anything to help Ukraine. That's because the perception in a lot of the world is that Ukraine is the problem. I don't yeah, know. 
been watching an old series what's been repeated about Putin and it's doing all the early history you know like from 2000 where he's poisoned uh, ex-KGB who defected and uh, jerry-rigging all the elections to get his people in power and you know this has been coming for 20 odd years yeah but you don't, you don't, you don't yeah well said it, it keeps sticking in the back of my mind that all of these current events and all of this stuff is not to sound like a conspiracy theorist but a, a reset it's the global oligarchy finally nailing down all of the corners that all of the major players are all coordinated in this i i can't shake my brain of that possibility I still think the real goal for Putin is to engage NATO. But he's using the Ukraine to get NATO to react rather than him attacking a NATO country and being recorded in history as the aggressor. He wants NATO to attack him. So he I, can say, we're defending ourselves. That's not a bad. I that's not a bad theory. My I had a dream the other night that uh, um, it didn't go the way that that Mr. Putin wanted it to go, and they used a tactical nuke on like Mariupol or Kiev, and uh, like not not thermonuclear, like global thermo thermonuclear, but like killed twenty five thousand people in a tactical nuclear strike. I think that's far more likely than anything else that this continues to be go the way it's going, which I think they thought the Ukrainians would give up, but obviously they're not. Well, they will not give up. It's unlikely he would do that because he wants. He's trying to tell everybody in Russia that that they're not that this isn't a war, that this is a special military action. Yeah, to free the Ukrainian people, the pro pro Russian. Uh, Ukrainian folks, I get that, but you know, oh, it's all fake. It's all fake news when we find uh, mass graves with hundreds of people with their hands tied behind their back. But no, the, the mass graves. How, how long is that going to go before? This the friend of mass graves that you get three days ago. Ugh. Okay. I'm not catching up. You look off and the interesting right. thing about I'm the interesting sorry. thing about uh, f f um, satellite photography, like Maxar, Maxar technologies and stuff, is that you can see it. You can see the damage. Why? Well, why? The thing. What I wonder about in the Second World War, they used to be able to, and, and the First World War, they could work out where the guns were firing from by the sound. Why can't they target where the missiles are coming from and send them back? They're coming from across the border and uh, coming they, from Russia. If they strike Russia and Russian territory, that's a different ball game. You're no longer defending, then you're attacking. Watch me for the right turn to Heading Bug 317. Heading Bug 317, my mark, stand by. Mark, turn right, headed for the tower again, kids. seems to be very one-sided, you know, that he can just deny anything, saying it's just fake. Why don't they just do the same? Well, that one was made. The fairies are sending them to, sent to you. <laughs> the fairies. Good enough for Putin, isn't it? Say, well, he ain't us sending missiles, even though it was made in Russia. I also had another dream that the uh, Ukrainians intercepted a Russian tactical nuke and sent it back to Russia. Or used it against Russia. I don't, don't tell me that's not possible either. That's going to be a problem. It's well, you see, Ukraine, when the Soviet Union fell, Ukraine was left with a, a massive nuclear stockpile, which made it I think, the third largest nuclear power in the world. Yeah, where did it go? They handed it back to Russia under a treaty agreement that Russia would leave them alone, which now Russia has violated. Yep, that's right. Oh my goodness, I did not know that. Thank you. Yep. They 
disarmed so that they could be independent. It's the ordinary people that I, I just can't get over. It's like people that are just trying to raise their families and feed everybody and take care of business it looks like they're caught in the middle of this stupid shit. It's like I see myself every day. Yeah, good luck with that. Yeah, exactly. That's yeah. Good. Yeah, it's probably why Putin's living in isolation. Exactly. I mean, say, look, 20 million dollars to whoever delivers his stuff. There is a battalion of Russian deserters now forming a, a force to go back into Russia to take on their own government. I'm not sure that this, when I say that I think this is all coordinated effort, I'm not sure that this is not what this is all about. It's, let's have it all out and get it done with. Going forward, we can I think 90% of us all just want to do what we're doing right now, which is have a couple of drinks and fly virtual airplanes and have fun, guys. Well, we'll have to watch what we say. You know, let's say Mr. Putin's such a nice person, otherwise we might get hacked and sabotaged and fly whatever. nice. Whatever. That happens anyway. Yeah, it happens anyway. Yeah, we got to be what? careful at Flight Gear UK not to say anything politically. What oh is, no, we, oh, we never okay. do it. Okay, this, this building up here, the one with the big gold dome, somebody knows what that building is. It's intriguing me. Uh, I think I heard someone say it was Les Invalides, but I don't, I don't know where there? we are. At least you I, I, I think I can see... Yeah, I kind of... I thought I, I, thought I could see Notre Dame over there, by, over the, on the river. It is there, I can see it, I can see it there at 3 o'clock, yeah. One thing this war has proven is, Russian armor isn't as great as what he thought it is. It's like a buddy of mine, or my nephew just got out of the Marines, and uh, one of his buddies who's into the uh, armored stuff said, yeah, well, the Russians have a huge modern army. Well, no, the portion of the Russian army that's modern isn't very big, and the portion of it that's huge isn't modern. All right, we're gonna do the tower again, guys. Let's make a couple passes through. It does look like Paris from the air. It does look fabulous, man. I'm, that's why the, we're here tonight. The, the center of Paris, the buildings are the correct type, shape, and, and position as well. Yeah, someone, that's why we're here tonight. Someone, I, and I'll say it again, no, they probably won't watch the movie. Whoever did all this work, yeah, um, thank you. It's a tremendous amount of effort, and um, I'm trying to appreciate it. I'm probably not being right. politically correct, but I super appreciate all the work that went into this. Oh, amazing. Message on Twitter from Where Is My Cap? He says he is KLM 37 LOL. Hello. I think it's a KLM 37 flying somewhere nearby, is it? I think I saw him on the pilot list. Hang on. He was flying F 16. No taste whatsoever. No taste at all. I put that on ignore long ago. <laughs> Sorry. There's a set. There's a Cessna 172P now. Uh, Cessna, bye bye. Well, we'll do that now. Or would you think?
Uh, all he says is, is nice scenery and he left. Well, there'll be nice the, scenery every week if then if they get a chance to make it. Well, yes. Even though I can't really get the benefit of it because my machine's too bloody slow. Ah, that's what happened to me, and then eventually I just like had him build me a machine. <laughs> I really want to do. I really want to live for flight night and do all this stuff with my friends. Okay, well, we're gonna have to spend some money on a machine. And you know, it, it runs, besides being really good for flight gear, it's re also really excellent at, for uh, running my uh, Persona Studio One uh, audio studio and stuff. It's just awesome. Well, I think that's my problem because this machine's got all the software for everything else also do. On it. I'm just orbiting to take the video. Who the hell put that wind turbine in there? I don't know, but it doesn't seem to bother us much. The other cougar. See the other guy here. One, this guy's want me to fly through the Eiffel Tower, so they have to do it now. Uh, Come on, dude. Please, of, end the please of yours, eh? Do it, do it, dude. Fly through. Come on, brother. Is this live? Are you streaming this live? Yes, I'm streaming live on Twitch. <laughs> daka, daka, daka. Whoa, whoa, whoa! That was cool. I went through the oh, tower. Oh, wait. Uh, I've got no elevation control. Ran into some oh, sunny head on. Oh no! What, did you hit something? Oh no! I've got no pitch control, attitude control or nothing. Uh oh. What oh shit, hit? oh shit. No, 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 no! I, I'm getting black out, I don't know where the hell I am. Oh, you're gonna die. Oh, it's been nice knowing you, Stu. <laughs> Let's see if I can make it through the second story. Here we go. Boom, boom, boom. Oh, God. Oh, God. Oh, I'm too young to go for Splat and Zeke. The Eiffel oh. Tower seems to have disappeared now. Second story. Oh, 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 my God. Sorry, guy. If you're taping stuff there, <laughs> I was too busy panicking to read it. I made it. I made it through the second story, boys. I've been zero down out of here. Oh Jesus, what the hell's going wrong? Hit, hit control R and start over. Yo, there we go. Yeah, I flew through it. Happy? Yes, I am. I'm thrilled. You got no cojones if you haven't flown through the Eiffel Tower on flight night, bro. Alright, I'm gonna make one more pass and then we're gonna hit the river. Gonna fly into that bridge and then we're headed for our final destination. Daka 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 daka. Oh no, oh no, like a elevator, like a elevator. Oh shit. Yeah, I'm gonna die. Oh my god, this is cool. I am dead. Yes, I'm dead. Control R. Oh my goodness! 
I don't know how that's possible. Hit five and see if you can recenter everything. I have to, I've been recenter, but it's just not. Yeah, there's no there's no damage control in these five planes, man. No, I think it must stick in this game. Oh, that It's working, right. but not a lot. Find my red smoke. I'm going up the river here. Come on, come on, find me, kids. That uh, that building you was on about with the gold dome, and I think it's the Cathedral Saint Louis de Invalides or something. Les Invalides, yeah. I can't find your red smoke. I don't know where I am, though. I see red smoke. Climb to 1,000 feet, maintaining 105 knots, slowing down so you guys can catch up. Catch up, boys. Oh, oh, tower view is badass. I don't know where you are. I'm lost. I see red smoke. Stand by. Let me check. Consult the magic oracle map. Where is Stuart? Where is I'm nearly. Stuart? I'm nearly able to tell at the minute. Um, I see you, you're not far behind me. Um, can you see, and rogues? Oh, like, there's smoke there, there's smoke there. There you go, look to your left. There we go, there we go, there we look go. Look at you, oh my goodness. Nudo, you have completely disappeared from me. What? You are, for me, you are in the, in the pilot list, but if I am trying to view it from you, there's nothing and the auto it, it doesn't matter whose perspective I'm looking from but you're completely gone me and the, I have citizen ignore. Might might be a server disconnect. A multiplayer say, might be a multiplayer server say, disconnect. I can see everybody else might try like um, either changing servers or just disconnecting for a minute or reconnecting. Right, I think we've got my trim is reset. Look at you! Thank you. I think. Who do you? You'll have to make one of them uh, tow, towing banners to advertise the flight night if, when you're gathering scenery. Can you do that? Uh, yeah, that's one of the. Um, one of the, the the yeah, there is. I think there is a way to do it because it uses the ability to send text over um, multiplayer as well. Hmm. Next destination, our final destination: Lima Frogstride x ray X-ray. 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 <laughs> the hell's X-ray? <laughs> X-ray, X-ray, read all about it. Food leads a bunch of crazy people who are flighting to Paris and they're all toilets. You probably thought you were practicing like a 9-11, you know. Oh you know, god, to, come on. To crash, it, to crash into... Uh, the Eiffel Tower or something. Everybody in flight gear knows I'm a whack job by now. Come on. Yeah, wax job. Whack, whack, whack. Not wax. Whack, whack, whack. Wait, wax yeah, job. I could use a wax job. Linda Fox tried X ray uniform. Five minutes, five to 52 seconds. I'm at 105 knots. Uh, GPS FMS oh. uh, 318. Assessed or just floated past me? Bye -bye. Yeah, there's one on the flight uh, list, pilot list. I thought it was a That should be remedied momentarily. Momentito. There's an alpha jet there now as well. Hold on. I don't know, looking back behind me at the formation and um, whatever midtown Paris and all that stuff, the scenery is awesome. Oh my God. Um. I have got the Cessna on at Ignora. That's interesting. Ignore's not working.
why it's kind of weird because when I shoot from Oscar Yankee's perspective, I have no aircraft. It's like I'm shooting out of the uh, shooting video out of the uh, the video assistant or something. Yeah, it was a uh, like that. Uh, but a few for me too, but uh, then I uh, switched server to the Zurich server, and uh, now I can see you. They were actually punish me for image of the claim again. Yeah, that's it. Uh... Oh, I'm catching you up, though. Look at you! What? Clever boy. What? Catch it up. No, I said I'm not catching up. Oh, you're not catching up. Well, I'm flat. I'm, I'm flat out, and I'm not catching up. Stand by. Uru, can you see me now? Stand by. All right, refresh weather, Stu. I'm holding 105 knots, so you should be able to catch me. Oscar Yankee, you are not on the list. Jesus Christ, that's a big fail we are down there. What the hell? Right, I have refreshed the weather. Flash, flash! Ah. They won't save any one of us. Seems to be some server madness tonight, boys and girls. Is it better now? I still don't see you on the pilot list, brother. Warp. Try to and left. Do you still not see me on the list? Let me, let me exit and return, Stella. Disconnected, I reconnected. Still no Oscar Yankee. Oh, God, you're lost in space, bro. It happens to me all the time. Usually I get visited by aliens. Instantly after that, so but we know what it is with you in the probing. Business, you know? Yeah, it's the probing stuff. But yeah, just, just don't go into the light, bro. Do you see me now? No. No. No, you're missing off my list as well. Oh, can you see us at all, or, or can you not see us? I can see you. Oh my there, goodness! There are a few. Oh, there right, you are, you, now you're You just list. reappeared. I just connected to uh, the uh, 87. 87, okay. 87? Yes, 87. But the new UK server, That's the same one I'm on. That's the what? same one I'm on. 87. Must be a new one. is the new one, is it? It's a London one. Is it any good? Seems to be fine. Well, I'm running out of scenery. Oh my goodness. I think it's a bit misty as well at distance. Well, if we're, if we're using server one, you know what everybody will go for anyway. Yeah, but there's a, there's a new UK one that's uh, started last week. Uh, um, Ready yeah, yeah, MPC for 87 is what I'm on, and it seems good. It's in London. I'm still can't keep up with you, but uh... yeah, I, I can never keep up with the, the the group, and I'm doing a ground speed 180. 18 knots. Uh, see, my ground speed's 108. I'm at 105 knots indicated. My ground, my ground speed is 104. I'm doing 100. 
Well, there's been that's been flat to the board. Wow, refresh your weather. I just refreshed mine. I did refresh it. An unexplained phenomenon. I'll change the weather system. We seem to be in the twilight zone here. Anyway, we're only about two minutes and I have no see. Oh, there it is. Oh, I can see it again. Woo! My core high pressure let's take. 87 doesn't work for me, doesn't, not don't. It ain't proper English, dude. Okay, we have a secret one just for members of the UK. Uh, we have considered that many times. That's UK's own server. Yeah, Timmy was running one for a while. Really? Yeah, what happened to? I don't know. Right on the money. Yeah, I've done refresh my weather and now I'm, I'm going too fast. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Even though know. the ground speed's the same. My ground speed uh, is still 104 knots and the uh, speed is still 112 knots. So, changing the core high pressure didn't make any difference. Turning left, TPS FMS 174, TPS FMS 173. I'll head you up with the boss. Uh, Lima Foxtrot X ray uniform. Be there in 2 minutes and 50 seconds. We got 5 minutes left. Oh my god. I've timed this perfectly. Look at me. I am a flight here, United Kingdom flight. I got. Uh, okay, well, I got carried away. There's a flashing uh, beacon over to the right. Is no, that the one you were seeing it? Oh dear, Rianex just crashed his cougar. Ah. Here and I was saying some cool things about it too. Yeah. Holy voodoo. <laughs> <laughs> oh my god. I have a flight here. God. Good proximity, kids. Ooh, nice video. Oh, oh, oh. oh. Uh -huh. right. Red smoke puff. Are you, are you tuning or are you just like popping smoke for Is that Oscar Yankee? I'm gonna take your smoke away, young man. Oh, now we got other, everybody's doing it. Come on. I gotta give you guys but smoke. But Oscar wouldn't smoke. Yep. It's green smoke. No, it's red smoke. No, it's pink smoke. No, it's white smoke. Oh, I knew you were gonna do that. Catch it. Oh, wow. No more fuel. Kids, no more fuel than that. Oh, no. <laughs> Tower view is cool. All these aircraft popping smoke and flying in. Oh, fuck. Overfly Lima Foxtrot X ray uniform. We'll turn left, come in from that direction and land. Uh, I think it's going to be on uh, runway 28 right. It ain't right. Oh, you ain't right. Oh, I'm Lucas. Look at you. There we go, boys. Screw it up, did you? What happened? 
He died. Yes, uh, I saw that the dress right in front of me, but right. Shut up. But uh, right. You saw nothing. You saw us now. Okay, the gods, the gods can't die. Just don't encourage him. Who? Me? No, Oscar Yankee. Well, there's a the runway right there. Look at you! Hey, on pain and nails. Forty five knots or forty five miles an hour, whatever those things be. Oh, yeah. Where are we talking up? Um in the middle of the thing there's a crossroad that leads between the whatever, whatever. We'll park up in the grass there in the middle. Alright. There's a load of bloody cones on this runway. There's cones everywhere. What? Traffic cones. And if you hit them, they, um, they're hot as well. So. Central uh, uh, runway that runs between the taxiway and the runway. We're going to park up on that. I think you're behind me. Is you got next week, by the way, we're doing. Oh, cool. Donut them. You can. Oh yeah. Just uh, hit L, unlock the pseudo tail thing, and hit a. Yeah, you can spin them all around. They're cool. They're not authentic, but they're still a lot of fun. Look out, Sonny! Look out! Don't kill me! Oh God!
Hey, kill that smoke. Who's got the smoke on? Kill the smoke. Me, I'm just uh, repainting uh, the aircraft. Well, we survived. Those of us who are left are all right. <laughs> uh -huh. Well done, everyone. Yay! Thank left. you. Well, we have the numbers for style, right? There you go. Yeah, <laughs> well, they all have that on flight, mate. Oh, wait, somebody's still, somebody's still trying to park up. So, anyway, Alex has got next week, so I won't ask for a volunteer, so nobody has to be frightened. We'll uh, pray for Gary, because we haven't seen him for like three weeks. That's right. I hope nothing bad happened. Oh, we probably ran out of the scotch. Well, that was uh, funny. We're not crazy, we're just forgotters. <laughs> Yeah, that's pathetic in its own way. Well, that's a great turning off the live broadcast at this point, so thank you very much for watching if you did, if you didn't watch. Yeah, yeah who cares? Hey, I'm killing mine too. Good night, Mom.